Trust in the Lord with all thine heart, and lean not unto thine own understanding, but in all thy ways acknowledge God, and he will direct thy path. Welcome to Testimonies with Akeem Smith, the show that brings miraculous, transformed, motivating, and inspiring stories across Jamaica. It is um, the returning of Testimonies with Akeem Smith. And just before I allow anybody else to come on this great return, I want you all to know a little bit about Akeem Smith. So in this video, you will be getting the, uh, the chance to know where I'm from, the type of music I like, the type of uh, uh, scriptures I like, and the type of maybe food that I like and stuff like that. And uh, so I don't want you to go nowhere. Stay right there. Get your mother, get your uncle, get your father, and let them know that, hey, come and know something about Akeem Smith. And also, before, before I we go into the video, if you want to know a little bit more about me, you can send in your questions, you know, and every week, there will be a video post of an introduction of myself. So stay tuned. The video of getting to know Akeem Smith is coming up right now. Hi, everybody. So this is Akeem Smith, founder and host of the Testimonies with Akeem Smith. So many persons wanted, you know, want to know a little stuff about Akeem Smith, where I'm from, you know, why, why I started this, this, this platform, um, you know, etc., etc. So I have my, would say my producer in the background who will be asking the questions and I will answer. So I hope that at the end of this um, little interview session, you can know a little bit about Akeem again Smith. Go ahead, sir. All right. So what inspired you to start this type of ministry? All right. So how would, did I start this talk show? Um, one day I was at church and a friend of mine said to me, Akeem, why don't you start a YouTube platform? But I said to her and to myself, what am I going to post on YouTube, right? So um, at, at the first off, I was posting clips of me at church, singing or leading worship and stuff like that. But one day I was in bed, in, in the bed, and I was like, God, I need to do something more, right? And it's like the Holy Spirit has dropped testimonies. You know, first, first, of, first of all, before Testimonies with Akeem Smith came about, I named it AS Testimony Talk Show. So AS Testimony Talk Show. And a lot of person asks, hey, Akeem, what does AS stand, stands for? But AS stands for Akeem Smith, right? But, um, you know, to be having persons asking me that question over and over, I'm going to say, hey, you know what? I, I, I'm going to change the name to Testimonies with Akeem Smith. You get what I'm saying? And so that's, you know, that's how the name came about. And that's how I started this platform. So many persons, you know, life um, blessed of this talk, talk show. And I've also helped persons, you know, like with money, money-wise, through my platform. I remember I received over $90,000 just for one person off my platform. So this platform is a blessing. All right. Love to hear that. So when did you become a Christian? Because I noticed... It's the main focus of your story. Right. All right. So how, when did I accept God as my Lord and personal Savior? I did it at age um, 11. At age 11. So how did I start it, guys? Um, so my father, he got saved, right? And he said that he wants myself and my, ba my, my sister to also baptize, get baptized as well. Because one thing with my father, whenever time the thing is good, he's going to, you know, ask us to be a part of it, right? Because he don't want us to leave behind. And so I got baptized at age 11. Yes, I was playing, playing church, one foot in, one foot out. But then I realized it makes no sense playing church, right? I, I'm not saying that, um, you know, that I don't sleep sometimes, even though I made up my mind, I sleep many times. But at the end of the day, I repent and I say, hey, God, I, you know, I'm going to worship you. So I got baptized at age, ele at age 11. So it's going 14 years, uh, 14 or 15 years since I gave my life to God. Uh, no, no, I'm, eight, I'm actually 25 June. This next month, I'm 25. So do the maths. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right, all right. So with that, we have to ask you, yes. what parish are you from? All right, so I'm from a beautiful, beautiful parish of St. Elizabeth. Santa Cruz, St. Elizabeth. <laughs> all right. You see? 
we have to love that. But in all of this, what is your end goal for this channel? My, my what? Your end goal. My end goal. All right. So basically, I just want to allow persons to come and share their story. This platform is all about, you know, motivating persons, right? And my, my goal is just for this platform to reach, um, you, know, the, you know, reach persons across the globe, whether in Canada, US, or Jamaica, because at the end of the day, the Bible said that it is our testimonies we're overcomers. And so when you hear my testimonies, then you're going to actually be motivated because you could be going through the same situation as me. And so I allow persons to come share their stories so that persons can be motivated and uplifted. Hope I answer your question, though. All right, one more thing. For some of your viewers who may not know, uh -huh. you are a wonderful singer. That's right. <laughs> if you watch clips on YouTube from maybe New Testament right. and other churches that you've visited, we see you singing. Yes. When did that start? Or is it just a hobby? Um, I would say um, maybe I was born with it. It's a gift that I got from God. And I remember when I was a child, I used to you know, go in front of the mirror and sing and, and stuff like that. But, 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 but at the end of the day, you know, growing up, I realized that, you know, I used to actually, let me say, is it travel or suffer with fear or stuff like that? But um, since I'm more mature and big and stuff like that, sometimes it still affects me, right? But I ask God to let fear, you know, go behind of me. But how I discovered that I'm a singer, as I said, was in the mirror. And I've went on many platforms, but you know, overseas online platforms here in Jamaica. I've been on Mark, Mark Stewart platform. I've been on so many big platforms in Jamaica. And so that's the reason why, that's how I really discovered that I'm a good singer. Even though there are room for improvements, right? And also not only that, but I'm a good worship leader, good prison worship leader. So I can't wait until, you know, the church that I'm currently in, I can't wait, wait until they actually see me you know leading leading person into into worship in terms of being on the worship team all right we love that so two final questions i was just going to show them at you yes right back to back <laughs> so favorite scripture and favorite gospel song all right i have so many um my favorite scripture though is seek ye first i believe it came from Matthew 3 verse 13 or 31 or something like that right seek ye first the kingdom of god and his righteousness and everything will be added and must added you know i believe in that because God's word never lies, right? And before God's word lies, then I believe heaven and earth is going to pass or something like that. But um, I believe in that scripture and I believe in God. I have faith in God. The Bible says it is impossible to please God without faith. Or without faith is impossible to please God. Amen. So having faith, you, you know, trusting God and having faith, then you will see everything that you hope for and, and seeking God for is going to actually come to pass. My favorite scripture, my, I mean, my favorite song, I mean, I have so many favorite songs, but one of them, I love this song. It says, um, I trust in God. I trust in God, my Savior, the one who will never fail. He will never fail. So I love that song. And there are many more. I mean, Kevin Dunswell, you know, one of my favorite Jamaican artists. You know, um, one of his new song that says, um, "Oh, I don't, I don't know, I don't know how it go actually, but it says this is gonna be my year, right?" And so I was saying to somebody last and that, "Hey, I am declaring over my life and over this talk show that it is going to be my year." You know, even though we're actually in the middle of this year, but I am trusting God that everything that I am seeking and praying God praying and asking God for, it is going to come to pass, right? By activating my faith, by trusting God and believing God, it shall come to pass. We love that. We love that. Thank we you. We love that. All right, guys. This is the end of the short <laughs> interview. If you want to hear more from Akeem Smith, you, you know where to find us. Yes. YouTube. If you want to hear him sing, we have, he's on multiple platforms at this point. So That's just right. check him out. Keep up to date. And remember to subscribe. Click that notification bell and have a wonderful day.